Hold on, let's just get some stuff set up. Audio. Okay. So we're currently in the Philippines and we're at Bacon National. I swear, if if your airport is called Bacon National, then yeah, I am interested. Oh, look at that. I forgot what this one was called. But it's a feisty little fellow. Like, you can just hear that it's a feisty little fellow. This is the first time I'm flying this one, so let's hope it's moderately controllable. I swear, I love bush flying in Flight Simulator. It is just such a pleasurable experience. And unlike the cadet, this thing can actually climb out. It is actually doable. Initial impressions, it's quite controllable. I like it. Oh yeah, and it is fast. It is fast. I'm just like using that map on the bottom right as a reference. And yeah, we're hauling. We are hauling. I can't say the full, what I was about to say, because, you know, it's, you, you, you get what I'm saying. Look at that. Degrees, yep. Is that an airport? No, that's not. Would you look at that? Do the gear... Wait, you can't... I think you can retract the gears. Or we're like... Head Caspi Approach Beechcraft Alpha Sierra X-Ray Golf is type Beechcraft V-36, two miles southwest of Romeo Pop, Lima Zulu. Request flight following. If... I, oh, would you look at that? That is just so gorgeous. Beechcraft Alpha Sierra X-Ray Golf, like Caspi Approach. Squawk 5216. Squawk 5216 Beechcraft Sierra X-Ray Golf. I'm like flying along these. Right? I swear I hate ATC on this thing. I. Copy Beechcraft Sierra X Ray Golf. It is. ATC just does not shut up. Gaspy approach Beechcraft Sierra X Ray Golf. Cancel flight following. We're like headed straight for a mountain. Beechcraft Sierra X-ray Golf, like Aspi approach cancellation received. Squawk 7000. Frequency change approved. Oh yeah, our flaps are still out. Our flaps are still out, so let's just take care of that really quickly. That's the like next Aspie approach Beechcraft Alpha Sierra X-ray Golf is type Beechcraft V364. Miles west of Romeo Papali, Missoula. Request flight following. Beechcraft Alpha Sierra X Ray Golf, like Aspie Approach. Squawk 3771. Squawk 3771, Beechcraft Sierra X Ray Golf. Like, honestly, we are barely avoiding these mountains. We are we're like a little bit off course, but we need enough altitude to like cross over these mountains. Seriously, how do I? Copy Beechcraft Sierra X Ray Golf. Okay, at least now they should shut up. Please. Yep. I guess that solved that issue. ATC is quiet. And...
we're kind of pitching up. We're still pitching up. Nope. Let's. Oh god, I cannot get over how beautiful this sim is. Like, I really cannot. At least it looks like we are getting back on course, like, we're like halfway to our destination. Our destination airport is like somewhere over there. God, this is so relaxing. This is so relaxing. Just bank. I really hope I remember the name of this plane because this is so much fun to fly. It would suck if I forgot and then if I had to like go over every single other turboprop or like propeller plane in the game just to find this one again. That would really suck. Look at that, this sim is beautiful. What's the funny thing is that I have not let up on the throttle like one bit since we've taken off. It's been at like 100% ever since we've taken off. I get used to the jets like so quickly that um, I just totally get used to their speed like in a jet like in the A320 or like the Citation this would have taken like what five minutes to like cover this distance you know what since since we're like out of the mountains let's just get down Let's actually hug the coastline. Or like, you know, the treetops. Let's hug the treetops, see what's what. We have like an intricate river basin system over here. Let's see what, you know, let's see what it hides. We're like losing altitude quite quickly almost at 200 knots. Let's just fly over this little city here. We've got like, yep. That voice that says 500, that's like so sultry. Is this, is this city flooded? Like legitimately, like yo, what's up with that? The city looks like it's flooded. Wait, was that, was that the airport that I was supposed to land at? I have no idea. Okay, let's just...
let's just gently make this right turn. I need more RAM. I only have like 8 gigs of RAM right now. And so for that reason I need more. I'm thinking of getting like another 8 gigabytes of RAM and upgrading it to like 16. Where's the... Oh, there's the airport. We're like... Why do I always come up on a runway at 90 degrees? Why? Okay, this is like actually quite a big airport. So let's just like fly out. You know, maybe to like those... got the flaps down look at that we're like lifting we have like a lot of lift actually know that I killed too much power I need like a little bit more power oh god oh my oh my by the beard of Odin more power I need more power by the beard of Odin. Please. Show me that runway. Show me. We're like kissing the treetops right now. Where's that runway? Where's that runway? People of the Philippines, I apologize for crashing on top of your virtual houses. Yeah, these houses are like packed quite tightly. So if I were to, if like a plane were to go down here, that would, it would be quite bad. So at least we're like, oh, okay, spoke too soon. Oh God, you remember how I told you that this, this plane was, kind of controllable. Yeah, I kind of take that back. Hey, we ended up on the runway and that's what counts. So yeah. Thanks for watching, if you're still watching.